Hello, my name is Christine Imms and this is Dido Green. And together we've been co-editing a new book. The book's called Participation, Optimising Outcomes in Childhood Onset Neurodisability. The book will be released by McKeith Press later this year. It's yeah. been a fun job. Yeah, and Christine and I have been uh, thinking back about the early emails when we started discussing the book and reflecting on why did we write this book <laughs> and why now? It's a, a great question, Dido. We really threw ourselves into this book because we wanted to bring to the fore this idea of participation and really bring together uh, a lot of knowledge that's been generated in the last two decades around how to support and enable participation uh, when people have childhood onset disability. You know, the ICF was published in 2001 and that definition of participation that really got people thinking across health and education about what should we be focused on. But what do we mean by participation? Well, in this book we define participation consistent with the ICF as involvement in a life situation that has two important elements. The first element is attendance, so actually being able to turn up in the situations that everybody else turns up in. Are you there? Are you in the soccer club? Are you at school? Are you playing musical instruments if that's what you wish to do? So turning up is really important. But the second essential element that is often missed is the involvement element. So participation is attendance and involvement. Now you can turn up to soccer and be on the sidelines. We actually want people and to understand how we promote involvement uh, when involved in different life situations. So those are the two essential elements. So in a way, it's both the physical and the emotional aspect of being there yeah. and being involved. Yeah, it's the experience. There. It's really the experience. And I think, um, so that sort of the why and why now is that it's a really good time to actually bring together a body of knowledge to launch into the future. And really that was what you and I thought a lot about, about how we would structure the book. Yeah, and the structure has taken, um, what we tried to do is capture uh, experiences from experts around the world mm -hmm. and shape both the theoretical concepts as well as how those are applied in context. So we have five main um, sections to the book. The first dealing with the concept of participation. And then the second, the context is where we do it and how, and how does that look like in different situations. And then the third, measurement. What do we measure and how do we measure it? And the fourth being um, related to interventions. Not just considering participation as an outcome, mm -hmm. but participatory interventions where it's the process of being, being there mm -hmm. um, as, as importance. And that final section, um, looking at some of the challenges that we have and thinking for the future of where we might go. But what we really wanted to do is uh, take more tangible and accessible um, these concepts for, for people, our readers. And so we've got woven throughout our vignettes from across the world of real life stories from children and parents and um, professionals um, placed in different contexts. Mm. And, and that really does bring to life the richness of participation opportunities that can be missed but we want to promote. And, and it also speaks a little bit about who this book might be for. And I think we've written this book um, from an international multidisciplinary perspective. We have brought, we've been lucky, really, really, it's been such a pleasure to work with experts from around the world to contribute to the book. Um, and, but we're aiming to, to speak to people who are professionals working in healthcare and education. Um, so this is a book for people who really want to work focusing on participation as the means to the end. So starting with the end in mind and working with participation now. So. It's, if you're interested in doing that and promoting participation outcomes, we hope you will have a look at our book and enjoy it. And we thank our co-authors co who've contributed so much from around the world to this book. And thank you, Dido. It's been fun to do it with you. It's been great. Thank you.